Well, tracking a pretty chilly one here on this Wednesday. I'm Jason Laird with the Montana Egg Network, continuing with our USDA crop progress report. Obviously, cattle and calves have really been a uh, big talking point here, especially when it comes to pasture movement coming out of the late summer, early fall with all the drought conditions out there. Uh, so we saw a little bit of an improvement last week. We're kind of back uh, on track with normal here. 75 or excuse me, 76% move from pasture as of right now. Sheep and lamb sitting at 73. Uh, so again, that's pretty much right on track with normal little bit of an increase though here from this last week in the terms of supplemental feed. No surprise there with all the snow uh, drought conditions. Not a lot of change as of now. Still dealing with the worst drought down into South Central Montana. However, the uh, new monthly outlook. We are looking at drought removal still expected along the Rocky Mountain front. Good news there and drought likely going to persist though throughout the core of Montana due to those dry conditions. All right, a weekend cold front. Not a lot of updates with this still just looking like some mountain snow, maybe a few flurries into the plains, more of a wintry mix. Windy conditions will be the biggest impact on Saturday and then uh, Sunday into Monday. We're going to start to see some high pressure build. That's going to get conditions a little bit more mild, more on track with average temperature wise next week. So wind is going to really ramp up on Thursday. A couple flurries possible here this weekend with the passage of that cold front and again, more mild temperatures expected next week.